see you, baby. The UCU is all about saving water, whether it comes from a city line or groundwater, it all comes from the same place. But there's another source of water that's for free and it's accessible to everyone. Mr. Lomeli, please come to the front desk, Mr. Lomeli. One of the advantages of living in a tropical climate is mango season. One of the other advantages is rain. In South Florida, July through October is our rainy season. This accounts for about 70% of all our rainwater. This is also when 90% of mosquitoes move into my backyard. That's correct, Mr. Williams. 10.30 this morning, okay? See you then. Here in Homestead, we already had 20 inches of rain this season. That's an average of six inches a month. What if you can capture all that rainwater and use it to irrigate your landscape? Well, we're about to meet a homeowner that's doing just that. You have a little junkyard back here of all the... One thing I, I didn't really like when we moved into this property about a year and a half ago was all the irrigation pipes that were sticking up everywhere. You know, PVC pipes, ugly shower, you know, broken heads on them. So I, had a, I took a lot of pleasure in taking out the whole irrigation system and replacing it with an, a rain barrel system with soaker hoses that was a, a gentler, more constant means of irrigation. The, the amazing thing is how quickly the rain barrel will fill up from a, a tiny bit of roof. It just, and I have a 100 gallon capacity rain barrel, but it fills up within hours, I'd say of, you know, if we get a lot of rain, it'll fill up. Well, of course, we've, we've chosen plants that are on a list of drought-resistant plants. They're doing quite well. The, the soaker hose weaves right through all the kuntis on this side. I, I'm, I'm seeing right now four kunti plants, and the soaker hose, as you can see, reaches here, and it's the, the ground is moist from the soaker hose. And I can control the amount, the volume of water that flows through there, or I could cut it off entirely, for example, if I wanted to. The rain barrel requires some maintenance. You have to occasionally get the debris that does accumulate at the bottom of the barrel and do a little clean out. You can do that easily by unscrewing this whole apparatus at the bottom. And it, immediately there's a big uh, jolt of pressure, that, of water pressure, that will shoot out the debris. Next year, we plan to install another rain barrel of high capacity on the side of the house and, and then follow up with more drought resistant plants. So this will be self-sustaining and that's what we're trying to achieve. The Florida Friendly Landscaping Program from the Miami-Dade Extension offers rain barrel workshops all throughout the county all year round. Purchase a 50 gallon rain barrel for $40 and have it assembled with a professional. If rain harvesting is in the future for landscape irrigation, you can count on the UCU to help facilitate this process. Purchase and installation of rainwater collection systems of 80 gallons or more will be included in our 2013-2014 irrigation rebate program. Funding for the urban conservation is provided by Miami-Dade Water and Sewer Department.